Where do we come from? What are we? Where are we going? Is a painting by French artist Paul Gauguin, which was created in Tahiti. It is accentuation of Gauguin's trailblazing post-impressionistic style, and also considered a philosophical work comparable to the themes of the Gospels. Gauguin approaches the life cycle from a feminine perspective. The three major groups in the painting reflect the overall themes presented in the title. First group on the right side, especially a sleeping child here the crouching women a represent beginning of life. The girl surrounded by kittens demonstrates the purity of girlhood. The middle group symbolizes the daily existence of young adulthood. The figure in the center is placed in a Garden of Eden motif, she is picking fruits from a tree. Gauguin intended to represent this woman as sin, like the allegory of Eve. According to allegory, three crouched women near a sleeping baby may represent maternity and pain of childbirth as a result of sin, with representation of parenting after that. Along with the motherhood of a woman's life, Gauguin also displays the idea of domestic submission through the bracelet and collar worn by the mature woman on the left and the white goat, respectively. Finally, the state of seniority can be seen through the old woman on the left. In the final group, according to the artist, an old woman approaching death appears reconciled and resigned to her thoughts. At her feet, a strange white bird, represents the futility of words, or, the uselessness of vain words. Altogether, the painting from right to left suggests the cycle of births and death. Outside of this cycle of life, there is a blue idol in the background which represents what Gauguin described as, the beyond. Near the blissful people are two sorrowful women by a tree who stand in contrast with their surroundings. In front of these women is a crouched figure who lifts her arm. The three women have been interpreted by one scholar as representing the contrast between enlightenment and superstitious, irrational, even barbaric traditions. The painting is notable for its enigmatic subject and atmosphere. Some scholars have attributed these qualities to personal conflicts that Gauguin experienced while creating this artwork.